Hey y'all, what is up? It's Bianca back with another guitar tutorial. If you're new, hi, what is up? Glad you're here. If you're not new, welcome back. Today we will be learning Leave Before You Love Me by Marshmallow and the Jonas Brothers. So let's get started with the tutorial. So to play Leave Before You Love Me, you need your guitar in standard tuning and you do not need a capo. There are four chords, no bar chords, so we are loving that. We are keeping the song as beginner friendly as we can. There are two strumming patterns and one chord progression. It is so easy, you guys. I know you'll love that. So let's get started with the chords that you need to know. So first up, we have G major. E minor, the easiest chord ever, C major, and last but not least, D major. And that is how they play throughout the entire song, in that exact chord progression. So the only thing that's a little different is the intro is just the G major chord to the D major chord and then you jump into that chord progression. That is literally the only other thing. The two strumming patterns I have for you, the first one is down, 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 twice per chord. So down, 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 down. So what I do like to do for this strumming pattern is I like to palm mute it. So what you do is you rest this part of your hand on the strings close to the bridge of your guitar to create kind of that percussive. That sound. And like I said, it plays twice per chord. I like to play it in the intro and the verse. It sounds the best there. I like to accent the first, the fourth, and the seventh down strum. So it would sound like this. Down, 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 E minor. Down, 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 down. sound like this. I will shut up for this so you guys can really hear it. for that last D major chord you only play the strumming pattern once and then you kind of like mute it so that would lead you into the chorus your chord progression stays the same as I've said before that makes it super easy it is a little more intermediate there's kind of a lot going on so the whole pattern is down 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 up up down up down down up up down up it's a lot going on there so let's break it up so the first section is down, 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 up, up, down, up. Next section is down, down, up, up, down, up. All together, down, 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 up, up, down, up, down, down, up, up, down, up. Let's play it a little slowly, adding the chords and it'll sound like this. G major, down, 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 up, up, down, up, down, down, up, up, down, up. Once you get into the groove of it, it's not that hard. I recommend that you practice it. And that is literally all you need to know to play Leave Before You Love Me by Marshmallow and the Jonas Brothers. That's it. You got the chord progression and the two strumming patterns. So let's get into the full playthrough of the song. Mm -hmm. 